New at 6, Marquette students are now getting treated to fresh local produce at their dining halls. Sarah McGrew shows us how a new partnership between the university and 100 Acres Farm is sprucing up students' meals. 100 Acre, an urban hydroponic farm, just opened up in January. Producing a custom salad mix and fresh Genovese basil all year round. We've been out to their farm in Milwaukee's Century City Business Park to see what they're growing. They've already partnered with local cafes, restaurants, and grocery stores. Our farm is designed to handle institutional uh, buying needs. Now that basil and spring mix is in Marquette dining halls, giving students a local and sustainable meal option. The two products that we offer, it's not something fancy like a, like a roasted chicken or, <laughs> or even strawberries. These are pretty simple products, and it's not about the product. The greens are means to an end. So we're hoping that these, these basic products find their way into the their menu program and that it's just something that they are they they streamline and establish. Tuesday was the first day students found the leafy greens from 100 acres on their plates. So I had the the Asian chicken salad and it was incredible man it tasted great. The produce will continue to be in the daily rotation of meals Marquette students have to choose from. So a lot of our residents dining halls have daily salad bars so it'll be featured in, in that area burger stations, featured items. Beyond keeping students fed, the hope is that it becomes an educational experience as well. With building a larger footprint farm, that space now becomes a platform for hands-on education and workforce development in the future of ag tech. And students are already taking notice. Well, it's something that I didn't think was important, but seeing the impact it can have on companies that are local to Wisconsin and Milwaukee, you know, I'm starting to realize how how incredible it actually is to be able to have this produce come in, have it served on my plate, and be blessed to eat that meal. Reporting from Marquette's campus, Sarah McGrew, TMJ4 News. Look